Hello, friends. So, my boyfriend has a tradition in his family that they all wear pajamas together. Usually they're matching. And since we are now living together in, um, on this Christmas, we decided to bring that tradition to our home. And I have a onesie and he has a onesie. They're different animals. They're, they're not matching. But us sitting around in our onesie watching a, a Christmas movie, um, Miracle on 34th Street, the 1994 version, um, and utterly enjoying it. And uh, yeah, I, I figured I'd settle in with a cup of hot cocoa in my PJs and read you guys a little story tonight. Hopefully I can have this edited and uploaded before everybody goes to bed, or maybe you can listen to this while you're wrapping some last minute presents. So I'm going to be reading A Visit from Na St. Nicholas by Clement C. Moore, also known as Twas a Night Before Christmas. Hopefully I can do it in one take. <clears throat> Twas a night before Christmas when all through the house not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care in hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children were nestled all snug in their beds while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads and Mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled our brains for a long winter's nap. When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters, and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new-fallen snow gave the luster of midday to objects below. When what to my under wondering eyes should appear but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick that I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid than eagles his courses they came and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen, on Comet, on Cupid, on Donner and Blitzen, to the top of the porch, to the top of the wall, now dash away, dash away, dash away all. As dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, if they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetop the courses they flew, with a sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. And then in a twinkling, I heard on the roof the pawing and prancing of each little hoof. As I drew in my head and was turning round, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot and his clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. His eyes, how, how they twinkled! His dimples, how merry! His cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard on his chin was as white as the snow. The stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bull full of jelly. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf, and I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye 
and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to, to his work and filled all the stockings when he turned with a jerk. And laying his finger aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprung to his sleigh, with his team gave a whistle, and away all flew like the down of a thistle. But I heard him exclaim, ere he drove out of sight, Happy Christmas to all, and to all a good night. I just wanted to share that little reading with you. Maybe I'll do this every year. But I hope that everybody is staying safe and having a merry holiday, whatever holiday you are celebrating. And I just thought I'd share a little, a, a little story, a little poem that uh, kind of fills your heart with a little cheer. Whether, you know, you believe in one religion or another. I think we can all agree that Santa Claus is pretty awesome. So, with that, I bid you adieu. May you all have a blessed holiday season. Until next time, may you have love, hugs, and ladybugs. Bye-bye.